how's it going everyone? Today we're making a scallop linguine pasta with a beautiful lemon butter sauce. So for the pasta we're gonna need 16 ounces of linguine, we're gonna need four tablespoons of butter, uh, two tablespoons of garlic, two freshly squeezed lemons, uh, a bundle of chives, about you know less than you know a fifth or a sixth of a cup, uh, the zest of those two lemons that we squeezed, and then we need uh, some salt, some Cajun or your preferred seasoning, and we need a bunch of scallops. These are a pound, about 16 of them. So when I'm cooking pasta, I like to make separate batches if I'm gonna do a larger amount. So that's why you saw everything you know, split in half. Uh, just because I don't wanna overcrowd the pan if I'm making the scallops, for example, uh, you know, when you toss in the pasta with the sauce, you don't wanna toss in you know, all one pound of pasta in like a small pan. So I'm doing everything in two batches. So now to cook our pasta, you wanna turn the water into the ocean, so add a lot of salt. This is the only opportunity to actually season the pasta. And then you want to give the linguine a twist and then you want to drop it just so it separates and it distributes inside the pan or inside the pot. So now we're going to season up the scallops with just a little bit of salt. Oh, not a little bit, but like a nice little hefty pinch of salt. And then I'm going to go in with the Cajun seasoning. Again, you could go with whatever seasoning that you prefer. I just think that Cajun is very simple uh, to go with the butter buttery taste of the scallops. So I'm going to go with a nice generous amount. I'm gonna flip them, season both sides. That's all you need for the uh, scallops because the pasta is gonna add a lot of flavor. I'm gonna flip these, season the other side. So when you're cooking your scallops, in my opinion, to get the best crust, you wanna use a cast iron or a stainless steel. But my largest pan is a non-stick, and when I wanna add the pasta, so I want the residue of the egg, Oh, it's not residue, but the fun. <laughs> I want the fun. So I want the fun of the scallops to actually, you know, resonate when I add the pasta, just to build that flavor. So because I don't have a larger cast iron or a larger stainless steel, I'm just gonna use uh, the non-stick. It's gonna you want to get a nice little crust on the scallops, take them out, and then add in, you know, your sauce. Cook. So you want to start on a very high smoke point oil and get your pan extremely hot when you do the scallops. They're a very quick cook. 90 seconds, so you wanna go clockwise. Literally by the time you place the last one, you wanna start flipping the other one. So our pasta is cooked, it's nice and al dente. I'm gonna say some of that pasta water for the sauce later. Okay, so the scallops just cooked, took them off and lowered the heat just a little bit. You don't wanna overcook the butter and the garlic when you add everything just to make your sauce, your lemon butter sauce. So drop the heat just a little bit, give it a second just for the pan to cool down and then it's gonna go by really quickly when you add all your ingredients. So let's go. So your mind might be screaming shrimp scampi because this does resemble a shrimp scampi in a lot of ways, uh, in my opinion. But there are a lot of differences, especially with the parsley and the chives and the scallop and the shrimp. So this dish is completely different flavor in my opinion and I love it because it's so fast and so quick to do. And it's it, like a little bit goes a long way. A lot of fresh, simple ingredients. Um, and we're about to plate it and eat it and it looks delicious.
And there you have it, folks. A beautiful scallop linguine. This is one of my favorite pasta dishes. And look at that beautiful final product. And as usual, thank you for everyone for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate the constant support. And now, bismillah. Creaminess um, with the pasta water because it's a little bit of starchy, you know, starchy. Why do I always mess up, bro, towards the end, man? All right, let's try that one more time. So your mom... Um, <laughs> Ready? Yeah. So your mind might be screaming scrimp, scrim. not shrimp, scrimp. What the? Scrimp. It's uh, short for shrimp scampi. Okay. You ready? And there you have it, folks. As usual. Keep recording. And there you have it, folks. A beautiful shrimp. <laughs>